One thing that I find very weird is society's obsession with virginity. There is a lot to be said about society's obsession with female virginity and the various misogynistic and deeply harmful ideas associated with it. Today, however, I want to talk about male virginity. I want to talk about the social expectation that men should have sex and the idea that virginity is essentially a loser trait. In the minds of many, loser and virgin are basically synonyms. They are frequently used interchangeably. Men are regularly subjected to expectations that they should have sex. Not having sex is indicative of being a pathetic loser. A social authoritarianism is enacted. A social authoritarianism that demands that men either have sex or get labelled as losers. Men are expected to have sex, and if they do not, they will face social consequences. They will be viewed as weak, pathetic, and inferior men. This social authoritarianism creates a pressure to have sex. People should be having sex because they want to, not because they feel like it is socially expected of them. People should not be feeling like their two options are to either have sex or be a loser virgin. This creates a very unhealthy dynamic in which people face social pressure to have sex. People should never feel any pressure to have sex. This is deeply harmful and entirely at odds with the idea of consent. It propagates massive amounts of insecurity and self-hatred. It coerces men into having sex. Nobody should face any pressure, social or otherwise, to have sex. This is deeply harmful and massively at odds with the idea of consent. Healthy engagement with sexual activity means having sex because you want to have sex, not having sex because you feel like it is socially expected of you. That is incredibly unhealthy. These harmful dynamics are constantly reinforced throughout society. Men are expected to have sex, and virginity is made synonymous with being a loser. Men face a social pressure to engage in sex. They must do so to prove that they are men, to prove that they are not pathetic losers. What is manly about enslaving oneself to harmful social expectations? In truth, there is nothing pathetic about refusing to let the harmful attitudes of others enslave you. But that doesn't stop such pressures from doing their work and leading to massive harm. From the propagation of insecurity and self-hatred, to their unnecessary restriction and control, such pressures are entirely unjust. Such a social pressure to have sex is entirely indefensible. This is all closely tied to the expectation of hyper-heterosexuality. This is one component of toxic masculinity. This expectation causes great harm as it coerces people and leads to insecurity and self-hatred. It restricts and controls people. It slaughters liberty. It gets in the way of people's ability to be their freest, truest, and happiest selves. The obsession with male virginity is weird, stupid, irrational, and deeply harmful. It needs to stop. Nobody should feel such a social pressure to have sex. We should stop expecting such things of men. We should stop holding men to such harmful standards. We should stop acting as if loser and virgin are synonyms. We should stop creating a social pressure to have sex.